Hi, this is Gail from Life and Splatters, and this is a really pretty piece I did last week. And what I'm doing right now is I have a, a lovely bronze colored metallic that I flooded the cir circular uh, canvas with. And I'm drawing my, my fingers through the paint and I'm, I'm creating a texture on the metallic, which will show at the end because my plan is to leave negative space. But this is an effective way to create some really interesting movement in the background of the painting. And you can do it with most metallics. It will work and you'll see at the end what it does. So I have layered a small flip cup and I'm going to create a fantastical bird in a nest. I'm already loving how the colors of this are sitting on the bronze. These are all metallics, except for the black. Uh, there's a light copper, there's a light pink, and I think that was a Modern Masters uh, pink metallic. There's black between every layer of color. There's a couple of golds in there. And I wanted this to be a very soft palette. Oh my gosh, look how pretty that is. Look at the beautiful cells. And this is simply uh, paint, flow trawl, and water. The cells are caused by the different densities in the paint but metallics really produce beautiful cells. And you'll see as I continue to stretch this out, the cell formation is lovely. Now I'm just using my palette knife to draw some lines in and out, sort of smearing in and smearing out. So when I smear in, I draw in some of the background into the colors. And when I smear out, I'm, I'm drawing lines out from the colors of paint into the background. pretty much have the composition that I want. I know there's a fair amount of paint on the canvas and actually the paint did spread out a little bit uh, as it, you know, as it sat, but it really is a lovely piece. Very delicate looking, uh, very subtle, and I'm very happy with this color palette. It's different for me, but it's quite effective. And here are the dried results. It's very soft. Uh, there's not a dark contrast. And it's because I used very soft colors. Uh, it is definitely a fantastical bird. And I see him holding uh, a piece of uh, plant material in his mouth as he's building his nest. And it could be her, because she is really quite lovely. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope I inspired you to try something a little different. Um, I'm not making as many videos as I used to. Uh, certainly find my attentions are going in different directions, which is fine. And thank you for checking in.